Hey everyone, how's everyone doing? So it's a Sunday morning, it is 10 to 11. I'm looking up there because my clock's up there. Um, so here I am surrounded with Halloween bits. I've got my creepy cloth, creepy cloth or freaky fabric, whatever it's called. And um, yeah, I'm literally getting covered in it. Um, yeah, I've got all the cobweb in. I've got enough cobwebs to bath in. Um, not so much. Um, so yeah, I'm just doing my little fireplace now. Just doing my little, with the cobwebs and stuff. And I've uh, cut some of the creepy cloth down just to like drape it in places. And that, yeah, so whatever I do, I'm just gonna do a video. I've been searching for my two tripods and I cannot find them. I haven't got a clue where I put them, so. Yeah, so I can't hold the phone at the same time and record, so yeah, so I will record everything that I've been putting up. Okay, so I hope you guys are okay. Right, so I eventually got round to putting it up. This is the sign, enter if you dare, that I picked up in, um, I think it was B&M actually, yeah. So I just got the stepladder in from out the back, <laughs> sweating out. <coughs> I've just taken down my haunted keep out so I'm going to find somewhere to put that now so I've put that up um, what else have I done um, oh it's cobweb over the light we don't use that light it does work but we don't use it <coughs> um, some little flower arrangements pictures I'm trying to think what else I put up. Oh, I've changed. So the headless skeleton has come over here. He keeps moving about. So he's over here now. And which he was over here. We've got the enter, if you dare. And there's something else. For me. Oh, put me, put old skelly and me. Yeah, and another picture out. I probably have already shown you this actually. Yeah, put some spiders up on my uh, kitchen uh, cupboards. I did put um. Oh yeah, that's it over there. Yeah, remember because um the big uh, creepy cloth or freaky fabric whatever it's called so rather than use all of it I've just chopped it up and um, so I've kind of just sort of scattered it all over around there oh some cobweb under the little fireplace not a real fireplace obviously and some over there hmm. uh, here she is yeah so she always yeah, she likes to be in my videos still. Yeah, so just, hi mum, say hello. Yeah, say hello to my viewers. Yeah, she was always saying hello to you. So she always likes to make an appearance. Yeah, although she did, she hated Halloween, didn't you? Yeah, so she's probably seen all this and thinking, oh my god, fathers, what the hell's he doing to my house? Yeah, she's rolling her eyes right now. She, <laughs> bless her. Yeah, but I did. T I told her. I said it's only for one day. It's only for one day. So, yeah. right. So I eventually got round to putting it up. This is the sign. Enter if you dare. That I picked up in. Um, I think it was B and M actually. Yeah. So I just got the step ladder in from out the back. <laughs> sweating out <coughs> I've just taken down my haunted keep out so I'm going to find somewhere to put that now so I've put that up um, what else have I done um, oh it's cobweb over the light we don't use that light it does work but we don't use it <coughs> um, some little flower arrangements pictures 
I'm trying to think what else I put up. Oh, I've changed. So the headless skeleton has come over here. He keeps moving about. So he's over here now. And which he was over here. We've got the enter, if you dare. And something else. Oh, well, put me, put old Skelly and me. Yeah, and another picture out. I'll probably have already shown you this actually. Yeah, put some spiders up on my uh, kitchen uh, cupboards. I did put um. Oh yeah, that's it over there. Yeah, remember because um the big uh, creepy cloth or freaky fabric whatever it's called so rather than use all of it I've just chopped it up and so I've kind of just sort of scattered it all over around there oh with some cobweb under the little fireplace not a real fireplace obviously and some over there hmm. uh, here she is yeah so she always yeah, she likes to be in my videos still. Yeah, so just, hi mum, say hello. Yeah, say hello to my viewers. Yeah, she was always saying hello to you. So she always likes to make an appearance. Yeah, although she did, she hated Halloween, didn't you? Yeah, so she's probably seen all this and thinking, oh my god, fathers, what the hell is he doing to my house? Yeah, she's rolling her eyes right now. See, <laughs> bless her. Yeah, but I did. T I told her. I said it's only for one day. It's only for one day. So.
Hello. Hello. Mm. Been a while since it's been up in my room. Mm. Isn't it? Mm. My viewers have missed you. Yeah, they have. Mm. You're famous. Mm. <laughs> yeah, so he's back again after spending a, about a month or so out in the back garden and the front garden, not wanting to come in. And it, you're back again, aren't you? Aren't you? Yeah. So I'm going to be turning my Easter wreath into a Halloween wreath. I've just taken off all the little uh, mini eggs, plastic mini eggs, and the little cute bunnies. And now I'm taking off the ribbon, so yeah, I've got some old white flowers that were mums. We don't, you know, yeah, they're old, so I'm just going to incorporate some flowers. Just, yeah. slowly coming together um so yeah so i put the roses in there do you remember the roses i got in poundland um because i've got two lots so yeah so i've put those in there some orange flowers that um orange poppies mum had and some white i'm not sure what those flowers are but yeah um i've just got to do more to it i've just got to put some more around the side um and put some more leaves in it I've got more glue over myself. Um, the um, that Gorilla Glue is really good, but it's so bleeding expensive, like six pound a bottle. And because, I don't know, you have to use quite a lot of it. Well, I do anyway, to get it. And then, oh, the little spider, little spider in there. So still got to do a little bit more to it. Um, dress it up a little bit, but slowly get in there. Mm. Hey friends, how you all doing? Hope you're all alright and I hope you're having a good week. Welcome back. Um, so today is Tuesday and um, I thought I'd do, like I put two videos in one. Doing, uh, yeah, so I did a little video yesterday, um, me doing Halloween stuff and all different things, DIYs and putting more stuff up, you know, in my living room and that. And um, so yeah, so so today's Tuesday, you probably see that I've got my uniform on, so back to work today. I thought I was off next week, but I'm not. I'm off the week after. Yeah, it's the Halloween week, so I've still got another, yeah. So six more shifts to do. So get in there. Six more shifts, and then I've got about, yeah, just over a week off. I'm off from the 26th to the 1st of November. So, yeah. Mm. Um, so, yeah, so I'm at work today, start at half three, um, it's two o'clock at the moment, and I'm just waiting on a taxi, I booked it a bit earlier, um, booked it for half two, so that should be hopefully turning up soon. So, I thought I'll quickly pop on here to show you, um, well, to let you know, um, another DIY that I'm going to be doing. So, do you remember I... So you remember I bought this mask? Do you remember? Yeah. Um, I think it was three pound, I think. Three or two, I can't remember. And then you had this going over it. So you put that over your head and so yeah, and then you had the mask like that. But um I've decided to do a little DIY with it. Um so I've cut it up and uh just trimmed around the edge and just pulled it pulled it off so I'm, i want to get a, i'm going to turn this into a ghost turn this into a ghost somehow i'm going to get a foam bowl get a foam bowl and put it underneath stick some black eyes in the mouth and then i'm going to get a coat hanger i've got one hanging up just up there 
on my door. So I'm going to, yeah. Um, so I'll be doing that in the week. Doing a little Halloween DIY. And then I thought, say he's throwing that away. Um, so what I've done is I've got my hole punch. Got my hole punch. And I've got some googly eyes. I can't remember where I got them from. But I've got some in a pack. So I'm going to stick some googly eyes in there. And with my hole punch, just punched a little hole in its forehead. Very nice. And then I'm just going to put some string on there. And I thought, save cutting it up and throwing it away. I'm just going to do like a little easy peasy DIY. Loop some string. A bit of, loop some string. Sorry. Loop some string through the hole and then just hang it up somewhere um, on Halloween. Yeah. So I've got to get some more glue because I've all run out. So, yeah. So once I'm at work, I'll be bringing you... Um, couple of more videos I'll be doing I've got to go around tonight and get a bit of shopping so I'll be bringing you a shopping haul and throughout the day I'll just be showing you my food what I'll be eating today yeah so I'll see you soon Here's the wreath finally finished and the yellow and white roses and the lavender um, and the leaves they were just flowers that I'd had well me and my mum had lying around the house flowers that we bought and the rest is just Poundland stuff the sunflowers yeah that I've had in Yeah, all done, finally done. Oh. Yeah, and it's got a little hanger on there somewhere. Yeah, a little jeep uh, rope to hang it up. Yeah, out my cup of tea. Yeah, excuse my bedroom. And remember the, yeah, that um, mask? Yeah. So I've painted it up using white and yellow and black uh, paint and stuck some googly eyes, super glued the eyes in, just waiting for them to dry. I've got sellotape to hold it down and a little bit of, oh, bit of string to hang it up with. Mm. Right, so here's my Tesco's haul, guys. And I got some soap and because my cat couldn't wait. He wanted some chick chick. There he is, fast asleep, bless him. I won't disturb him. So I picked up three of those. They're one ninety nine each. There's the other one. Now the other the other one's lurking in there somewhere. Picked up the creepy toffee apple filled muffins, they're one twenty. So I picked up some of those, then some chicken roll, get 20 slices in there, and then, well I want to call it a gingerbread man, but it's a vampire man, so that's for my little Reggie, little Reggie, um, when I go and see him tomorrow, so I'll be giving him that, uh, then some pasta, Fresh pasta, some din dins. Oh, there's the other chicken, sliced cold chicken. So yeah, three of those, and they're for Soxy because he absolutely loves them. Yeah. I think he loves them more than he does actual cat meat, actually. Then I picked up some Richmond meat-free sausages again, tasty and succulent. I love those; they're so so nice. Then a cucumber, 
which was reduced down to, from 43p to 11p so I can do some salad with that and um, then I've got, got some hobnobs McVitie's OT milk chocolate hobnobs got some of those then some well Tesco's cheap version of Canderell pick some of that up then I've got two lots of pineapple juice, Tesco's pineapple juice. I normally get the orange juice or apple juice and I thought I'd have pineapple juice instead. Two of those. Then I picked up some toffee nut latte. I love this stuff. And then some cheese sauce. Cheese sauce. I'm going to mix in with some pasta some pasta and me sausages might do that in the week or I do it tonight what time is it now? Oh, 9 o'clock finish work about half 7 but and then oh of course a bag wouldn't be a Martin wouldn't be a Mark Diva haul if I didn't buy a bag and three lots of super glue and they're in the club card deal so and I use these quite a lot for my DIYs, my crafting. So yeah, that's a lot. My Tesco's haul. All my lovely Halloween bits and pieces. six I've literally just walked through the door I finished at half five but I just quickly whipped round after work and got some more shopping so I did say I was going to bring you another shop well yeah I did a, a shopping some shopping on Tuesday yesterday yeah getting a bit sidetracked on what days it is so I say Wednesday so yeah um so I did a um some shopping yesterday but I realised I needed a few more bits today and uh, so yeah so I picked up a few a few things mm. so I'm just gonna you know go and get changed and then bring you a another shopping haul part two yeah, shopping haul so of course I picked up two bags because I've got my bags mm. So I've got two lots of Domestos bleach, I don't know if it's citrus fresh, uh, I'm not sure what that one, pink, thick bleach, pink power, two of those, they were 98p I think. And then I picked up some antibacterial cleansing spray, apple. Then some ice creams, chocolate and caramel. Um, got like all crunchy bits on there. They're like the Magnums, the Tesco's own Magnums. Um, white chocolate ice creams, and then some cal calippo, cal yeah, orange and lemon. Six in there. And then I picked up some Halloween bits. I picked up some fake blood. There's two there. They were a pound. Then you've got the Halloween projector torch, they were a pound each. 
and then you've got the buckets the trick-or-treat buckets with the ghost and the pumpkin and they were 50p each and I'm going to be doing a little uh, gift bucket um, for some of uh, friends kids so and I've got the chockies going there I've got the Twix so, and I've got some Milky Way Oh, I've got some bread for myself, white bread, a little toasty white bread. Then I picked up the lollies, bumper bag. How many did you get in there? Let's see how many is in there. I'm probably just not looking properly. Uh, but then you've got the Smarties, there's four in a box in there, some Smarties. Then I picked some fruit jellies up, the mandarins in orange. I like those, they're really nice. Um, then I picked up some cereal, because I haven't had cereal for a while, so I thought in the morning um, for breakfast and just for a snack. Um, some jam to go on my bread, jam sandwiches or toast and jam. Ooh. Then some caramel wafer biscuits. <gasps> mm. And then last but not least, some surface wipes. Surface wipes, yeah. Yeah, um, that's my lot. Yeah. Mm. So I've just finished my dinner guys and I've got, this is what I bought on Tuesday, the pasta, the meat free Richmond sausages and the cheese sauce. I mixed it all together and dinner, like a creamy cheesy sauce, macaroni cheesy sausage carbonara thingy, I don't know. A mess, but tastes nice. <laughs> mm. Right. So I just want to take this time, say to everybody, all my friends. God, I'm getting it all down myself, I'm like a baby. Anyway, so I want to take this time. To thank you all, thank you to all my friends who are watching this video and um, I really hope you enjoyed it and be sure to smash that like button, give it a like and uh, drop me a message down below. Still not receiving notifications, I don't know what's going on but I check my um, videos every day to see if there's any comments, any messages so I will always reply back to you. I always enjoy reading your messages. So thanks for your lovely messages that you send. So be sure to um, please subscribe if you haven't already and share my videos, share my channel with people, you know. And um, yeah, and I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoyed um, the haul and all that and the DIYs. And I shall be on here tomorrow because I'm popping out with my one of my good friends and a little spot of lunch and a bit of shopping um <clears throat> i want to go into wilco's into wilkinson's because when i went in there a couple of weeks ago they were just only putting their halloween stuff out so they only had a little bit out so i should imagine they've got quite a bit out now so i want to have a look in there um um so yeah so we're just gonna go shopping and um, so I will be bringing you a video of um, a few shopping hauls tomorrow and uh, me, whatever I'm eating and my, yeah, um, my day. So I shall see you lovely people uh, later. Um, excuse the way my face looks, I had a shave and cut myself to smithereens. 
with Tesco's crappy um, razors. I love you all. Take care. And thank you again for all your love and support. And I'll see you later. I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Bye.